If you are a medical student, you are supposed to hate biostates. You are supposed to hate these equations. But let's try anyways. These are 11 equations, just 11, and today we are going to learn all of them. So here is a summary. Sensitivity, specificity, positive predictive value, negative predictive value, odds ratio, relative risk, attributable risk, relative risk reduction, absolute risk reduction, number needed to treat, and number needed to harm. Out of these 11, the first four are really simple and all of us can somehow learn it. The real problem is in this area, from odds ratio down to number needed to harm, and we're going to understand these today. Let's try. Odds ratio. Its equation is AD by BC. And mnemonic is, I always find it odd that some dates are written with AD and some are with BC. Next is relative risk. Its equation is A, A plus B divided by C, C plus D. Mnemonic. It's an equation that is used for the cohort studies and in which we follow people that acquire disease that had an exposure, that is this group, A, A plus B, and then we follow the people that acquire disease and they never had the exposure, C, C plus D. So the attributable risk, we're going to subtract A from the rest. Its equation is A or A plus B minus C or C plus D. Explanation is attributable risk A R. We're going to subtract the A from the rest. A or A plus B minus C or C plus D. Subtract the A from the rest or technically it means exposed subtracted from the unexposed group. It attributes the risk factor responsible for the disease. So, uh, for example, smoking and lung cancer and HPV and cervical cancer. Attributable risk. Next is relative risk reduction. R, 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 R. So its equation will become as 1 minus R, R. That is uh, relative risk. And 1 minus A. A plus B or C, C plus D. Its mnemonic is very simple. You have to subtract one R from three R's. So it'll just become one minus two R's. That is relative risk, A plus B, C, C plus D. Next is absolute risk reduction. Equation is C or C plus D minus A or A plus B. In biostats, nothing makes sense so why should the spellings right so we can write absolute with a c of course we can write so it'll become absolute risk reduction with a c and now we just have to subtract the c from the rest c from the rest absolute uh, c plus c or c plus d minus a or a plus d. now number needed to treat equation one over absolute risk reduction or one or C plus D minus A, A plus B. It's about the treatment. It's about the absolute risk reduction. It's about the absolute. The absolute with a C. So subtract C from the rest. And finally, the last thing is number needed to harm. Its equation is one or attributable risk or one or A or A plus B minus C or C plus D. Its explanation is how much harm is caused by the exposure or how much can we attribute the harm to the risk. So subtract A from the rest and it becomes A or A plus B A subtracted by the rest. Uh, since it's not attributable risk but number needed to harm we can divide the whole equation by one and it will become like this one by a plus divided by a plus b minus c divided by c plus d